Good morning, my friends. It's Coach V. You're welcome to this beautiful morning stretch. All you need is your body weight, no weights, no machines, and we will build some amazing strength, energy, balance, endurance, and overall excitement in the body. It's the beginning of summer. So I want to know below in the comments, you can't even see my eyes, can you? In the comments, what is your favorite summer song, your favorite summer jam? Let us know. I asked this question a couple years ago, got great responses. All right, so without further ado, let's get to the mat and let's do some beautiful morning stretches. Modify as needed, always use control and invite people to join you that definitely need to start their day with a bang. All body weight, make sure you're breathing and focus. Bring it down onto your back. Let's draw the right knee in, left leg extends out, head up or down, inhale, switch. This is a variation of the classic Pilates move. Pilates, wait. It's a single leg stretch. Pilates single leg stretch. Inhale, exhale, extend this leg out, flatten your lower back, and stretch the hip flexor, the hamstring, and the quad. Exhale as you pull, inhale as you switch. A good steady breath, no matter which way you wanna shake it, let the breath flow through the body getting the mind all excited and invigorated. <clears throat> Two more times each side. Filming today in Decatur, Illinois at the Shastine Gym where I do guest classes. Gonna be popping around a little bit this summer. You'll see some, some different locations. No Florida for a few months. All right, head down, drop those legs side to side. You cannot start your day without some kind of rotational Ooh, move, rotational exercise. Extend the top leg out if you wish. Arms can be out or over the head. What you hear in my voice is a little bit of the allergies of being in the Midwest. Let's breathe them away. Inhale, center, exhale, twist. Getting the movement happening, all this stuff going on. It's an earthquake in your center right now. One more time, each side, flowing this together for you, give you the best start to your day. Knees into the chest, circle the knees. Ah, grinding, little pepper grinder here. Ah. Deep breathing, flush away the bad stuff. Out with the bad air, in with the good. Oh, there's a door going down there. Keep circling. All right, there we go. Our circles made the door just collapse. Other direction. See, you're outside, you have gators, you have otters. Inside, you have garage doors coming down. But we keep on moving. Nothing gets in the way. We can do these anywhere and any time and make a massive difference in our health and fitness. One more circle. <clears throat> All right, bring it up. And over, we have lunge twists. Don't even look at those notes there, they're secret. Right foot forward, left knee down, left hand down. Stagger the feet, inhale, reach up. We're gonna go back and forth, hand comes down. And then other side, you can bend this elbow. You're gonna definitely feel some tightness in the sides, in the low back, but that is why we do these, right? That's why we're doing all these exercises, all these movements to alleviate that, to open it up, to expand it and bring us back to where we need to be, where we must be. <clears throat> Two more times each side. Reach for the sky, my son's favorite new phrase, because he is a cowboy now. All right, other side, left foot forward. And commence when you're ready. Slide this knee back, activate the hip flexor. Inhale up, exhale down. Okay. Rotation, rotation. Look up to your hand. Let your armpit proudly display itself. Open it up. One of my absolute favorites for full body mobility right here, the lunge with the twist. 
all this rotational integrity, rotational strength and flexibility. I've gotten lost. Let's do one more time each side. Oh, it's a wonderful thing. Step it back, downward facing dog. Feet together, big hands, press back, and the metronome. If you ever play an instrument, especially piano, the instructor will put the metronome on the piano as your beat, as your rhythm. So we're swaying back and forth. Press the heels down, press into the palms. If you have never done this exercise before, it is very, very powerful, very profound. So take deep breaths, shake it out when you need to. Woo One more time, each side. All right, knees down, and bring it all the way down to the mat. <clears throat> Hands are on the shoulders, cobra. We inhale, lift up, let's add a pulse here. So inhale up, exhale, slowly lower down, accentuate the spine, decompress the spine, and get some movement up and down the back. Hey, my cap. Uh, 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 okay. You can also lift up higher if you like, drop those shoulders. You could lift the knees off the mat too. It's called an upward facing dog. If you're new to my classes or to yoga, so find where you reside in the movement and go. There we are, slowly down. Let's do two more. Great arm and shoulder strength here, isn't it? It takes a lot to lift. Drop the shoulders, squeeze the glutes. Energizing up and down the back, up and down the spine. <clears throat> and lower. Back to down dog. I'm telling you, that was so good. Let's do that once more. Heels together, legs together. The metronome. Learn to play... One of the first songs I ever learned on the piano is called Motorcycle Cop. Motorcycle cops on guard, chasing cars at speed. Anyone else learn that from the, Sh uh, the Schumer book, the Shermer book? What are those called? They're orange and green. You learn scales. <clears throat> you learn chords, progressions, keys, all that stuff. I mention that because music and fitness go hand in hand. You want the flow moving with precision. You want the inspiration behind it. And let that carry you throughout the day. Oh, good. One more time each side, working out the kinks in the sides. And then down once more into our pulses here. We've got to double it up. Return to where you were and expand from that spot. Good. Start your day with a huge dollop of strength right here. Two more times. And down. <clears throat> Child's pose. Right hand forward. Thread the needle. Active threading. Forward. Other hand. Reach the arm through, sifting back, shifting back once you draw the arm through. So this starts it and then we move back to really clamp down on the twist and the stretch. Right into the shoulder blade, oh yeah. Just what we need. Any time of the day, really, you got a chance to do these, do them. One more time each side. Don't think later on, oh, I should have done all those mobility movements. I should have done them with Coach V. Do them now. <clears throat>
whenever you can. Oh, that's nice. All right, sitting on the heels, shoulder rolls. Man, we're just blowing right through these flows here. You can also always pause the video and practice these separately. Inhale up, exhale back. All right, two more times. Open up the whole anterior part of the body, chest and the shoulders into a side lunge. Plant the foot down, other leg extends out. Whoop, let me go back a little bit. Hands are down for support. If this is too much, you could sit in a cross-legged position or with the bottoms of your feet together in a butterfly stretch. I'm gonna rock this forward and back. Let me go back a little further here. Let me whisper while I do that. <clears throat> All right, hands forward. So I press back and then forward. Digging into the glutes, into the hips, the hamstrings. One of our superhero movements. Two more times, press back. We can all use some good hip opening, some hip mobility, blood flow into the groin, into the glutes. All right, bring it to the other side. Little Spider-Man move, there we are. Open it up, extend away, press the heel away from you, hands down, and rock it back and forth. You can always hold the side lunge. Wonderful thing about body weight fitness, it's just you and your body, so make the necessary adjustments as you go along. You want to stay in the game, though. You want to stay in the flow. Stretch it out. Feel that stretch in the arms and the shoulders. One more time. Here it goes. Big stretch. Oh, yeah. You better believe it. Right here. Long, lean muscles. Okay. Bring it up. And let's come to a standing position on the back edge of your mat. I might pop off the your head. frame here for a second, but I'm still here. These are my feet. These are my legs. I'm going to do some walkouts. Let me switch the cap. It's very appropriate. Soften the knees, tuck the chin. We're gonna slide down into a forward fold, into a bend, into a hinge. Releasing the spine, then walk out. Into plank position, hands are in the shoulders or take the hands further in front. Drop the shoulders, feel that stretch of the whole body as the core fires its way up. And then let's reverse our path. We walk back, sinking the heels down, bend the knees. The chin is tucked. And whew, stack that spine as we round back up. Lifting, lifting, lifting. Very important, shoulders back and down. Let's do four more. So, releasing down, unwind and decompress. Walking out. Find your spot. Hold for two breaths. Feels good, doesn't it? Walk it back. We got all this control here. Over this body. We are moving in ways that will enhance our days and we are rhyming like Lewis Carroll three more times. <clears throat> let that breath flow through you. Let it activate the stretch. Let it activate the pose. And always practice, practice, practice. Two more. Oh, that's two right there. <clears throat> oh, I love the length of that pose. The length of this plank right here invigorates the soul, doesn't it? Rising up. One more time. Oh. 
All right, walk it back, all the way back to the feet. Bend the knees, rising up. Shoulders back and down, and there it is, my friends. Well done. Remember, leave your comment below. The random question is, what is your favorite summer song? Mine has to be Summer Song by Chad and Jeremy. That's what I said before. Invite your friends, and if this workout helped, please hit that subscribe button, the like button, click the notification bell to never miss one of my workouts, and uh, keep practicing. We're gonna have a great summer, my friends. Keep checking back here every week for new videos, and I will see you real soon. I gotta get a catchphrase. I gotta get a catchphrase.